I wanted to share this new technique um, I just tried um, using a can of mandarin oranges that are empty and uh, a pair of used stockings to make my hair look salon, salon ready. I'm going to give you a model of how gorgeous my hair looks. I think you would agree. It looks like I was in a salon. And uh, it took no time and, of course, no money at all whatsoever. So, well, I did, actually, I did, it, I did it with two cans, but you could probably use more. But I wanted to have a big, uh, have a lot of body. So, um, what I did was I took a can, you cut a can, and you could experiment on sizes. Um, I use um, this size, a toilet paper roll, or a, a use, not a used, but um, an unused can packs, you know, for smaller curls. Anyway, but um, you take your hair after it's just been washed, freshly washed, and you put it into the can, wrap it around the can, and uh, you can take a pair of stockings, you can cut them cylindrically. I like to cut them large for this. Or a pair of socks even, you know, doesn't matter. So this is kind of a thick pair. So I'm going to wrap it around once and it's going to hold up pretty good. Okay, that's it. So that's it and um, you could take a blow dryer to it, you know. As soon as it's, uh, I, I do it when it's pretty dry but really freshly washed. And um, this is how it comes out. I think uh, it's a cheap way to um, do your hair in these economic times, right? Okay, anyway, I wanted to also share with you some other projects I've been working on. Some of the new stuff I found and got, um, I'm real excited about. I found glitter glue. I'm so excited about glitter glue. I, you have no idea. So, um, I've made a couple of things with glitter glue. And, uh, what did I want to show you first? Oh, whatever. Oh, this is cool. This is my new, one of my new sewing, uh, sewing, uh, baskets. This is from um, a, a jar, or, no, actually it's, it's plastic, so it comes from a, a, a juice bottle from uh, Dwayne Reed, like that Akai berry juice. It's delicious. Um, anyway, I cut it in half. This is um, cut in half um, top side down, okay? And um, I just put a picture of a naked woman over the, uh, the um, pin cushion. You don't have to do that. I just thought you would be entertained. Um, I used a sponge as a pin cushion. I took a pair of used um, used lingerie. There you have it. This is a used lingerie on top. And these are socks. You know, these are socks on the bottom. There's some naked women across the way just for your entertainment, just to keep you interested. And um, I put a sponge inside of the um, lingerie part. So that's what I'm using. Is Isn't that cool? I hope you like it. And I have pins, so I have, uh, this is just for sewing needles, okay? Isn't that cool? I have one of these also for my hair. This is kind of cute. This is for uh, much smaller items. Where did it go? Uh, I just had it. Anyway, I, uh, oh, this is my um, can of mandarin oranges. I decorated with this blue tape. This blue tape is um, waterproof. It's so cool. And um, anyway, if you have an injury, um, you can use this in excess, though to make sure you don't get your injury wet um, so if you like a wound you know if you have to keep something dry but okay this is what you have to do first you do the band-aid then you wrap around the band-aid um, I think everybody uses gauze and then after the gauze they use this kind of surgical tape I have some because I'm a tape I'm a tape freak I love tape every tape I, I really enjoy using tape to decorate Hey, that rhymed. Anyway, you use the surgical tape. Then you take this, this is like almost waterproof, so you wrap this around your, I had a toe injury, so I wrapped it around my toe. Then you use saran wrap, wrap that around really good. Then uh, you can, then you take this and, and seal your ankle or whatever it is with this tape. And then to be extra sure, uh, I wrapped uh, two supermarket bags from the uh, supermarket around that. And then again, one more time with the blue tape, and my band-aid was bone dry. I took a shower. So, I, you know, one of those things. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this, and I hope you liked uh, my ideas. Um, let me think. One more thing, one more thing. I wanted to show. Here. 
Okay, wait. Ah, I'm in the middle of this, but maybe um once I'm finished. Oh no, I know what I was saying. Sorry, sorry, sorry. I'll be right back. There. Now this is cute because I just made it. I found this great silver tape. I had to buy it at a um, hardware store. There's a big difference in buying tape in a hardware store and buying it at Jack's. It's like a difference of about $12. Anyway, this is just like a medicine bottle, but this is for really small items. And um, I have those, like very small screwdrivers. I love them. Anyway, this is perfect. I, I needed something just this size, and this is what I found. And I decorated with just my favorite blue and my favorite silver. But I'm going to play with my glue. Um, my glitter glue. I love my glitter glue. There's my glitter glue. I can't show it off right now. But anyway, it's so much fun to play with glitter glue. I love glitter from the 80s. And I have this special coming up because I'm making something. We're calling it glitter. It's um, it's for um, Mariah Carey. She's going to be like my ultra, ultra, ultimate like needle holder. Or no, she's going to be my ultimate um, remote control holder. Anyway, thank you. Hope you liked it.